My beautiful Cancers, how are you doing? My name is Simply Valka, and today we're going to have a little bit of fun, darling, with some tarot cards. We're going to do some cards, Cancer, and see which what person is coming forward towards you right now. Now, how we're going to do this, Cancer, is I'm going to be pulling some cards, and I'm going to be getting some detail on the situation, and then it's up to you, Cancer, to see how this makes the most sense in your life. This could be someone coming back into your life that was, you know, previously an ex-energy, right? This could be a situation of something entirely new, or this could be a situation of someone where there's been a little bit of silence for a while, right? And you're trying to get a little bit of perspective. So it's going to be, we're going to figure all of this out through tarot and see what details step, for, step forward for you, Cancer. So with all that being said, let's just jump into your reading today, Cancer. We have the Dawn of Wands coming in for you, Cancer. So this is really honing in. In on the message of a fresh start truly when it comes to this energy cancer so you know we're gonna have to definitely pull some clarifiers on this because we could you know keep in mind uh, cancer this could be all talking about new energy which I would say 80% of the time it does but you know we can't neglect cancer my people who are giving someone a second chance honey right even if you know even if we personally cannot relate to giving someone second and third and fourth chances darling uh, some cancers may be trying to have a fresh start entirely for the 50th time right not a call out just an obstacle observation darling <laughs> so let's get some clarifiers on this cancer let's see if we can dive deeper four swords stepping forward to me in the reverse for you cancer so as well as the four of wands trying to come in from the back of the deck energy so cancers this is definitely honing in on a situation of um i'm getting this sense here this card wants to step forward as well the giraffe spirit see uh spirit coming in seeing the big picture Cancer, I want to be bold enough to say that there's some type of connection that you had in your life. Didn't really end up all that well with this Four Swords here showing it to me. Uh, probably was a little bit rocky, right? Maybe you guys, it's not, maybe it's too much to say that you guys are like, that you guys have like this disdain for each other, uh, Cancer, but there's like this sour note in your mouth right now when you mention their name, even though you care about them, and probably vice versa. And so, actually, yeah. Um, this giraffe spirit i see this is a situation where someone's finally kind of seeing the whole the bigger picture and things cancer you know if there was a fight recently um that happened or whatever caused this distance between y'all two at this point i do feel like someone's kind of coming at this from a more mature uh, mindset now and being able to see more sides of a situation and understand how or why the other situation panned out the way that it did or why the other individual individuals darling how are your situation is i don't know y'all's tea cancer it is showing to me someone just having a greater perspective and that's what's causing creating this fresh start coming in here well let's get some more clarifiers cancer we have the five of pentacles in the reverse so this is someone that was probably lashing out to cancer um from a little bit of a place of not feeling like they um i don't want to say they don't feel like they belong but they felt as if like they they couldn't see how y'all's uh lies would commingle uh anymore and for them it was one of those things dare i say their threatened was ego <laughs> What was those words? Their ego was threatened, darling. <laughs> what was going on right there, Cancer? So it could be in a very much so, in a sense where it's like, you know, Cancer, you're sitting over here thriving and you have a better sense of yourself and all this other individual. You know, you're kind of being like the reminder to them that there's so much more work that they could do on themselves. And so from then, they kind of just like had this point of where either they lashed out or what have you, you know, just started the spiraling of a uh, negative narrative it seems cancer and you know cause them a spiral but again with this giraffe spirit stepping forward cancer this lets me know like this individual plucking themselves out of the spiral at some point right let's get another card on this seven of swords in the reverse so all these cards uh cancer this is all telling me a situation of where for some reason this person didn't n initially really want to engage with you at all cancer there is some for some reason on their end they they had i don't know what their reasoning was darling um cancer but they whenever you were around they were extremely on guard it almost feels as if like i'm being shown a um it's not a burlesque mask i guess it doesn't matter what kind of mask it is i'm being shown a mask cancer and showing to me where it's like the moment that you're 
like even like the, your existence or your energy being brought up into a space or other or like you coming into the room immediately they have to like uh straighten up their back fix their posture straight you know um it's almost as if they felt as if they had to uh present a much more regal exterior than necessary when you were around for whatever the reasoning is whether it's like an insecurity thing with them cancer which it probably is for most people right or whether it's something about you cancer that makes them feel as if you know it's nothing to do with, you know it's not your fault of course it's just them you know having their own issues the hanged man coming in here so this is definitely someone who cancer i'm being i'm seeing someone who's just seeing a sh um I want to say bold enough to well, in a way, I would suppose it is like a change of heart cancer, but more so this is someone who is seeing a better perspective, a greater perspective and able to see just like, okay, yeah, I see where I could work on my issues here. I see how everything's playing out. Um, very much so someone that, you know, kind of lost their way for a little bit of cancer and naturally when someone loses their way they act out in a little bit of whatever way that they acted out in your life now this is not me excusing their behaviors cancer whatsoever right because i don't know y'all's situation but i am seeing someone where it's like you know they're just caught in too deep you know i feel like we all can relate to that on some level cancer where it's just like we get too overwhelmed in our own drama and our own mess that sometimes like um <laughs> you just act out in irrational ways sometimes not excusing the behavior but at least i only share this perspective cancer so that uh it helps you to not internalize the situation because i do feel like you guys were kind of left in the dark with this and kind of just left confused about this whole situation and be like well what's going on what did i do what did i do wrong right because i'm just being shown like a cancer that has just like two plates um <laughs> it's just like they're both full and just like i don't know what you want me to do with this right like you're just trying to have a nice meal and then like you're just like trying to be crazy um almost so it does feel like it was kind of out of the blue for your end like you couldn't process it cancer and it is like it does seem to be heavily like this individual seems to be heavy internal four of cups in the reverse this is definitely someone who hasn't i would say he's probably been pretty spiritually disconnected for a while cancer and spirituality aside this is someone who probably just hasn't felt like themselves for a little bit out of touch with themselves you know something this would be normally like an energy cancer or someone who you know maybe their diet hasn't been the best recently they haven't been working out they've just been eating like a bunch of junk right and so they just haven't been feeling themselves and just yeah it just seems to be like someone got themselves into a little bit of a neg negative spiral happens to the best of starling the chariot card in the reverse this is all about cancer um, i'm gonna wrap this up yeah two of wands in the reverse as well this is someone who probably just had an extremely depressed bout uh for a while cancer and is during that you know and as anyone that's experienced can or anyone that's experienced depression cancer knows that whenever you're going through that depression you can't it doesn't matter like who all is reaching out to you in the world or what have you it doesn't matter the details you know during that time you may not even have the energy to want to do anything right and i'm just seeing this person really having just like a issue just with their own perception and like what it is that's going on internally for them i'm not trying to diagnose them or anything cancer because this is just some tarot tarot cards keep this in mind right put this in perspective honey but i am just seeing this person who is at least becoming self of self-aware of the fact that they messed up and um do, are they going to be coming in with like some type of an apology the moon card coming in in the reverse something is going to be coming up for them so the more of a perspective that they get cancer i would say definitely anticipate some type of message something uh some type of hint uh coming forward to you pretty soon of their sign yeah six of wands is the spotlight card is the card of kind of bringing in positive news cancer so this is you know don't get too much anxiety if you do get anxiety cancer if you end up getting like a text from somebody from the past that you didn't uh end on too fabulous of a note with because i am just seeing just overall growth right this is a human that's grown a lot cancer so it's kind of up to you to decide if you want to bring this person back into your life because i am seeing this is in your court right the ball's in your court is the, what this individual did cancer was it severe enough that you just don't want to even be part of it anymore or is this a situation that you could look over right something that you could truly move on from should they actually have in, uh, 
really encapsulated the giraffe spirit, if I can grab this card, right? And really grown from the situation and, you know, will no longer catch you in, you know, blame you for their like internal spirals, right? Because, you know, just because everyone's going through something doesn't mean like it gives them the right to lash out <laughs> on like others, right? Just be, we all are going through something internally, honey, it's just a matter of managing it better. So yeah, Cancer, those are the cards that I have for you. Let me know how this reading resonated with you. If you did enjoy this reading, I do your weekly tarot scope reading. I do them every single week, Cancer. I'll leave a link to it over around here somewhere. If you'd like to book a private personal reading with me, my website's linked down below, simplyvelka.com, along with my social medias, Cancer, TikTok, Twitter, Instagram, everything is just Simply Velka. And yeah, I love you so much, Cancer. Thank you so much for allowing me the opportunity to do this reading for you. I am wishing you so much luck. Bye.